from zero to hero food plot. Dual coyotes at it again. We're at Curtis's 101 acre farm. Curtis is going to go ahead and mow the jungles, what most of them are. Four, five, six feet of brush, and some of them, anyways. And then I'm going to come behind with the chisel disc, and we're going to make some magic happen. This is the one that I did with mud. That's the problem when you have dirt that stays wet. I mean, it still ain't dried out yet. <clears throat> so I may be redoing this one, but it, it's a losing battle when you're deep in the woods. Um, when you got wet spots and they don't dry out. That's right, I forgot I made a uh, trail going around it last time to get out of here. I forgot about that. Trying to find out if he's going to come and mow first or if he wants me to start ripping it up. Hey, this part up. Alright, this is a uh, new opening we made with the excavators. <clears throat> He's got some corn that's doing really nice. Gonna angle that a little more. He's got some corn that's doing beautiful, so it's decent dirt out here. Oof. Piece of cake when you got four wheel drive. So, this little plot here, wanting to connect it to that hidden plot we found last year. Okay. Which is directly that way. So, here's a before look um, when we were strategizing where we're going to make this new opening and set of openings. So, uh, Curtis started in with his tractor with his coyote. And then uh, he rented a um, Takahoochee, and I brought my bobcat over there several times to yank the bigger trees. Mm -hmm. 
but just to give you an idea this is kind of what it looked like before actually you could see he had a brush cutter in here already he had a fecon mulcher so <laughs> it was actually super thick jungle for the true before look but this will give you an idea kind of the midstream and let's go back to today when you're, it's going to be all dirt and plant ready by the end of the day so all, all this on the left comes out yeah okay He's got another patch down here. Yeah, that's beautiful. That's how mine should look, but it did not fertilize enough. got a six foot bush hog and his uh, 6620 coyote that's gonna help a little bit getting it mowed but the roots is the problem here but this is perfect tool for the chisley disky the chisley disky the chisley disky Go tag team live action turtle man live action It's a disadvantage, but it's an advantage. It's it, when it catches everything. Look at how clean that dirt turns out. So I take it all the way to the edge, and then I pile it. And we push it off to the side.
bump outs here. It's gonna turn out nice as long as I don't break this thing. Um, it's it's gonna be nice. I think I can get it to be planting ready once I clean all the junk out of it. One pile at a time. Started my second pass. And I'm pretty sure in three passes it's gonna be plantable. Uh, you can see this one strip right next to me that that's pass number two and You see how much more rough it is right here in front of me So uh, it's I think it's gonna be plantable by pass number three So he won't have to come back and do anything I mean worst case I could do a fourth pass, but man, it's looking pretty good right now Okay, here's a uh, pass number three on these first couple of swipes, but then I get distracted and I start going the other direction, which is only pass number two on the opposite direction, because this this opening is kind of shaped like a um, a cross, a crosshair, if you will. It's almost like a long T. So I've got north and south and east and west rows here. So look how good pass number three is, and then when I switch directions, that's pass number two. Um, but we'll let this run and then we'll check back in and finish this out here shortly. Thanks. All right, here's the after look. Coyote's been just a beast, man. I mean, it takes a lot of torque to uh, bust the tree roots with this thing. Some of it I did two passes and some I did three. But this is ready, ready to plant. You could still run a drag over it or a cult the packer, depending on your preference. This is going to be a beautiful hunting spot for Curtis and his family. Absolutely beautiful. So it turned out fantastic. From zero to hero food plot. Food plot in a bottle in two hours.